We are at the vet and poor Monk is so scared. He climbed in this little hole. This one, he's in there. He climbed. Monk. Monk. You can see, you can see. Poor, oh, Monkey. <laughs> he's so scared. There's so much. So much noise and confusion in the lobby. He's so freaked out right now. Oh, the poor guy. Oh, this is the elusive tabby. Nobody ever gets to see. Oh, he's so cute though. He's a little cute little lover, but he's really freaked out. And then there was so much noise in the lobby with dogs barking and all sorts of crazy stuff. It's Saturday, this is a veterinary hospital, so it's not like you have an appointment. <laughs> He's retracted. You just kind of, you just kind of come. It's like a first come first serve kind of thing. Um, there are like vets, like cat vets I take them to that you have appointments and all of that. And it's better. The cat vet clinic is, there's way less stress than the cats. It's all cats. You don't have dogs and stuff barking and all the crazy smells and he's, yeah, he's so freaked. Poor guy, but he hasn't been able to pee. So he had this problem um, about six months after I first got him, maybe a year after I first got him, where he was trying to urinate and couldn't. So there's like, he gets crystals in his urine and he has a small urethra and so they plug the urethra and he isn't able to go. And he can, they, they can kill him because he can't urinate and it backs up and between the poison and not being able to, like, it just destroys your internal organ. So, luckily we noticed that he was going to the litter box, like, every 10 minutes. Steven did. And I'm glad, because I've been kind of worried about, you know, this happening again. He seemed like he was doing so good, but now we're here. Poor guy, and he's freaked out. <laughs> but hopefully it'll be better. And I, we've been to this before. I hope he doesn't have to stay overnight, because I don't have the money. Last time it cost me 700 bucks to have him do this because they had to put a catheter in him and then drain him and then they had to keep him overnight and they had to go through anesthesia and all this stuff and it was really expensive and I don't have the money like I I don't <laughs> it's either that or my mortgage like I can't you know so we'll see poor guy oh Mark. he's so scared oh raise my heart you want to say hi? You say hi? Aww. Okay. I'm not going to put him through this hell anymore. We'll go. Bye. Bye.